community i hope you are doing good in this discussion we will see how to create custom method in odoo and in case you missed previous discussion about how to add or override create method please check link is given in the description and if you want to learn more about odoo you can visit the weblens channel under this home screen you can see odoo development tutorial and right now we are working on this playlist if you want to learn from the scratch from the beginning you can use this playlist odoo 17 development tutorial so it will cover all these topics so those are the sub topics of this is the main playlist by the way if you want to test yourself you can go to the visit the community and you can try to your luck here right and guys if you didn't subscribe this channel please subscribe it will help me a lot so let's back to our main topic how we can create a custom methods all right so we don't need to worry about the custom methods because we already know how to add custom methods but this is the topic which i'm cover in the orm methods playlist so here you can see wb.school we already discussed how you can override the create method how to use the different decorators right how to pass the parameters what is the written type how you can call the super method in a different way but right now we will talk about in this discussion is the custom method so let's say you can see here all are the custom methods right so here i will show you how you can add custom method plus i will give you one more interesting example for the create method secret so yeah so let's say i'm trying to use here let's say create a custom method print clicked right the same method i will try to use in the oh oh, oh let's say school oh sorry this is the school student right now uh, let's forget about this part and i'm trying to upgrade this module in case you don't know how to upgrade modules using the pycharm configuration please check editor level playlist i already explained how to configure so here once i will go to the student profile one let me refresh the screen and let me open any of the record you can see custom method button is available let's say once i clicked you can see the print automatically update here the print statement right here you can see so like this way you can add here the custom method in the custom method you can also add the different types of decorators something like this right you can use on change you can use the depends you can use at the red api dot sorry the model but you have to understand the decorators first and then after you have to implement here the decorators one more thing is you can also add here parameters you can also add written statements right it's up to you the custom that's the called the custom methods custom means it's your method you want to do anything now here what i will try to do is the create method what is the difference between this api model and api model create multi we will talk about these two different scenarios in the using the custom method okay so first thing is uh, we already know how the custom more uh, sorry this api dot model and the model create multi is works right so here we are trying to do the same thing so here i will try to create one json payload and i will try to create some school records from this from this school model oh, sorry the student model right so let's say self.env and here w.school and simple we have to create the sorry the call the create method 
okay here let's say data name web lunch record okay so this data i'm trying to pass here i will try to restart the service but i don't want to upgrade the module so once i click it successfully clicked without any error and you can see here first it's clicked right then after you can see these two statements already print these three statements from here so actually it's called the create method right after that you can see it's called the super method so you can see here it's print the model uh, sorry the instance then after the wells what we passed and what it returns it's also we print in the create method the very interesting thing is you can see here the wells wells you can see here in the list of dictionary and what we passed is only the dictionary see that is the main difference here with the decorator but let's say if i will use here the model let me restart the service once i click you can see here we pass here simple dictionary format and in the create method it's also get the same dictionary format not the list of dictionary right here one more interesting thing is if i will use here something like this list of dictionary if i will pass here into this create method you can see here it's converted into dictionary so that is the main difference here with the decorator so due to that uh, from the version 16 onwards we must have to use this decorator this is very beautiful let me give you one more example and yes one more thing is i, I forgot to show you the records you can see these three records already created let me delete you can see total nine record is available for the school right let me go to here and i will try to increase one two three four and five so total five record is here you can see it's in the list of dictionary right now i'm using here multi decorator right once i click five different types of records right and if you go to here you can see the click our custom method called and we call the super uh, we call the create method so first one is the instance it's null but here you can see only calls once the create method right and it will return this record set now let's say if i will change from multi to the model only or let's say in the single single and model both are the equal for the create method all right let me delete these five records let me click or oh, and one more thing is let me remove all the logs you can see it's a huge difference right custom method call once after that you can see uh, we passed number of five records right total five records so five times create method call so here we call once but as per the decorator we used model and due to that 
we pass five different records to create but the decorator automatically convert into a single dictionary and it will call single five times create method and you can see this one it's written like this it, it's written like this it's written something like this it's written something like this right the five times but the very interesting thing is if you print this one you will get all record set together not the single time not the single single records we will return no we will return list of record set once i click here and you can see here this is the written statement we print but actually create method call five times so that's the beauty of the model and the create multi and also Odoo always suggests once you create uh, override the create method you can see always this decorator right so now this is up to you which one you have to use that's your call so yeah so like this way you can add a new custom method you can do a lot of stuff using the custom method I just give you some idea like you can also call ORM method different types of ORM method I just used here create but you can also use the right method you can use different methods you can also call this JSON store from here using like this self dot something like this and it will automatically call this method and perform this logic whatsoever we provided here all right we can also call the private method self so let me restart the service let me close everything and you can see clicked right and yes very interesting thing is once we change decorator to multi it's not calling uh, five times that create method it's called only once the create method so here the code is also optimized from your side if you are using the multi decorator I mean this decorator create multi okay so if you have any doubt related this custom method please comment below and see you in our next session and our next session would be how to create how to override the right method all right see you in the next session